Hey guys, say hi to everybody, Ruby. Yes, Rock. Ruby has a big surprise today for everybody. Ruby is five weeks pregnant at the moment. Yes, you are. And guess who did it? It was at this moment he knew. He f***ed up. Guess who did it? Nope. Yes, you've been a bad naughty boy. Yes, you've been. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Ruby, how you feeling, baby girl? She's been pretty tired lately. You can kind of see her belly right now. She's five weeks pregnant. Look at that cute face. She's gonna be soon to be my mom right here. I don't know how many puppy she has right now it's gonna be a surprise when it comes out because everybody everybody likes surprises after she uh, after the first heat we decided to get her spayed so since the pandemic and everything which I didn't know we call like four different um, vet places and each every single one of them was there was a wait I think I called in July um, we called in July and the wait was between October to December of last year. Once we got to the vet in October for our visit, um, they had like breakout on the neck. You can kind of see it. Rock kind of had it a little bit worse than Ruby. Here's Rock. So... You can kind of see it again, but it was everywhere, throughout the whole neck area. Same for Ruby. When we came in for the first appointment in October, the vet said because of the the um, the rash on their necks, he wanted us to wear take the antibiotic for about a couple weeks and come back for him to look at it, and then we can reschedule for the spade. So after a month, we came back and the vet looked at the um, the rashes and he was okay. It was an okay to make the appointment for the spading, which would be um, a little over a month or maybe a month during that time period, which was in uh, November. She was in heat. And I was very, um, we were very worried. Like the first heat, we had to do diapers and even body suits for both of them, which they didn't like, especially Ruby. But they tend to like to um, help each other take the diapers off each other. And um, since it was Thanksgiving day, it happened on Thanksgiving day. So everybody in the household was busy getting ready for the holiday and so they both take uh, their diapers off and, you know, did that thing. Yeah, Rocky over here pretending like he's not listening. He's not, he didn't do anything wrong. Nope. <laughs> but, so they got stuck on Thanksgiving Day. And I was pretty scared that um, there was, she was going to be pregnant. And we waited, waited. And... It didn't really show. She didn't really show like her belly. Uh, her nipple was getting a little bit bigger, but I was just my. I was. I think I was just being paranoid. Around the fifth week was actually the one that you can see the most of. After the fifth week, you can see a big difference. We don't know how many she's gonna have, so it's gonna be a surprise for everybody. I'm hoping she might have three because. If not, this is going to be a handful. You guys are already a handful. Ruby here and Rock, especially Rock. He's a handful. Ruby here, she's just chill. She's listening. She is a well listener. Rocky, he just does his own thing. Yeah. 
But the plan is we're gonna keep all of the pups. We don't wanna get get rid of them. We wanna keep it all in the family. Yes, you excited to have your babies? Hmm. Hmm. You ready? I'm gonna. We'll be keeping. We will be keeping you guys up to date on everything, her pregnancy, everything like that. See, so yeah, here's the belly again. There you go. This is about five weeks, I believe. All right, guys. Ruby, say bye to everybody.